So hello guys, Microsoft launched Windows 11 new update in the Dave channel build is 22523 and as you can see I already installed and the best part of this update they are providing the ISO file for this update so you can directly download and upgrade. I will also tell you how you can download that. First let me tell you what are the new things in there. So basically there is no new feature but there are some changes and improvements. Okay so let's see what are those. First is related to your snap layout like you open two programs here. Now you group these two and whenever you hover on this open taskbar you can see here group of these two programs right but whenever you press add plus tab so they are saying like we have fixed this but i think still it is not fixed you can see in recent tab it is not showing in group okay so i don't know what they have fixed but this is they are saying on their blog we have fixed it but it doesn't look like it is fixed okay you can press add plus tab you can see nothing is inside group okay so leave it and next improvement is related to file explorer like whenever you open this pc you can go here you, you can see here one option like connect to media server they have moved this option to in this setting okay so you can directly find it from here and they have improved some other setting like uh, related to control panel whenever you open this control panel so as soon as you click on this uninstall a program so it will open in this setting so they have moved this thing to this setting app like you can uninstall these things from here you are no longer to uninstall apps from this control panel this is a the thing they have improved and the another thing is related to uninstall windows 11 update so whenever you go here update and go into update history and you click on this uninstall update so you directly navigate to this control panel then there you can see these update to uninstall but now you will see these updates which you want to uninstall inside the setting app so these are the some improvement they have done in this update and there are lots of fixes in this update they have fixed some battery issues like whenever your laptop is charged to 100% it is showing beyond 100% like 100 to that is just fixed now so basically they have fixed lots of problems in this update so i would suggest if you haven't installed the latest windows 11 i would suggest use this iso to upgrade okay so you will fix lots of issue in that because microsoft already fixed lots of things and windows 11 is giving more performance than windows 10 right so no issue with that if you want to download the iso so you can get this link from the description so scroll down to the bottom here and select the build like this day build this is our latest build click confirm and here you need to select the language like english or united kingdom click confirm so now you can see they are giving some error here we encountered a problem processing your request no issue with that you can try after some time you will get this iso from this page maybe there is some server issues so okay guys that's it for this update i hope you like this video so just hit the like button and do subscribe if you are new on this channel so okay guys thank you so much for watching this video